Gay people are the same as normal people. No, gay people are normal. What is prejudice? Because, because to, to this day, I went to college, four years of college, there's nothing that, no course taught that taught about prejudice and racism, which there should. I don't understand homophobia, racism, or anything of the sort. It's a huge problem in today's society, and I feel like to this extent it isn't talked about. I'm just saying, if I was the president, this problem would not exist. <sighs> Bro, please just let the intro play. So tell me when you come home. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, tell me when you get here. Yeah, yeah. I really want to see you right now. I don't understand prejudice. I don't understand the trend of hatred against random people. How could you be an everyday person, wake up, and part of my French, and get angry at someone with the question of, why are you black? Now, uh, wolf aside, was that really, uh, appropriate? Yes. I don't understand racism, homophobia, or any prejudice at all. It's a form of anger and an ingrained ideology that I was never able to sympathize with. Whether it be media, and TV, social media, games, forums, and people all around, hatred against minority groups have lived in one way or another, and is always at a stable amount of people no matter how much time goes by. Acknowledging this, making this video isn't my white Minecraft YouTuber way of tweeting, racism is not poggers, and getting 100k likes. I just do not understand prejudice. For the life of me, I can't wrap my head around how you could be so mad about a woman being the face of a film or about two guys kissing. I don't. I'm a kid lost in the supermarket looking for his mom. In fact, I remember almost never seeing any racism, homophobia, or sexism in a genuine manner, and I was really thinking to myself, this world is so peaceful. Everyone around me is so kind. I was so clueless and naive, till I downloaded TikTok and saw it for the first time in years. That app has the most hatred I've ever seen, and it's mostly glorified. You could have trends based entirely on making making fun of the LGBTQ community, calling them fatherless, misgendering them, and more. Or entire threads about women and just blatant misogyny. And that is what I don't understand. To put it in a really ignorant way, I just do not understand oppressors. I faced quite a bit of hatred in my life and witnessed it all around me. But I have a monkey brain. No thoughts. I don't get it. You see me? I have a mindset where I try to understand why everyone else feels some way. I try to be empathetic and see things from everyone else's perspective no matter the situation but I just do not get it. Any type of hatred towards minority groups is taught. It could be religiously related or just blind. No baby is born out of the womb and is like, rah, I'm not quite acquainted with the gays. Or, I do not dabble in the indubitable shade of their skin. As a parent, that is taught. No child will stray away from another just because they're the opposite gender or a different color or a different sexual orientation by default. Your brain automatically chooses love. Humans like people, humans like other humans. Despite their differences, that is nature. I can't denounce someone else's background. Since stuff like equal legal rights for all races wasn't a thing till just a few decades ago, and gay rights till the last decade, but even that's shifty. So yes, people were born in different eras and had mindsets growing up that opposed this. These things were once foreign and told to be wrong for generations of their own. And I'm not going to be disrespectful and denounce someone's faith or adult's feelings either. You were raised on these core values and beliefs since birth. So while you hate people like me since that's all you've been taught, me returning with the same hatred wouldn't solve anything. But in today's climate, when you grow up and are surrounded by freedom of expression and open mindsets on the internet? How could you still be like, oh, I hate minorities. They ruin everything. They want to be involved. They want to be the main characters of movies, own land, and have legal rights. <laughs> I've even known people with very open parents who comment on videos calling someone the F slur. On the real, most of my hate comments have to do with my sexuality. It baffles me, blows me away. Need a detective on this case even. It's a real case with homophobes, man. Why is it such a big deal about what another man is doing? That's a little gay in itself. You're upset and angry over another man's thoughts. This shit got me weak. I had a dude in my old class who would always call me the F slur when he saw me, but was never around any women, ever. How are you mad at me for living my life, but you can't get any pussy of your own? That's the real hilarity to me, actually. Actually. Motherfuckers be 16 complaining about gay people not being normal and men becoming too feminine while they're struggling with a nicotine addiction and not washing their own ass. What's the real worry on earth? Aw, oh, you look malnourished. Dear's how the creator, I would like your music. Do you like boys? Mm -mm. Dear Frank Ocean, I would listen to your music. But you like boys. Mm -mm. This is even a bigger mystery with prejudice against people of color. Get this, right? I guess I can understand homophobia and transphobia. It's newer. The Christianity point and the Bible are brought up. It goes against what you believe in. I can get that shitty point, but at least you have one. Even then, it's morally wrong. The Bible, um, Leviticus 18, 22. 
um, it is man should not lie with man for it is an abomination. However, um, that verse is wrong. Um, originally, it was man should not lie with young boys talking about pedophilia, but they changed it in the 40s to man should not lie with man to talk about homosexuality. Ooh, so they're wrong. Yeah, I'm rock with those people. Thank you. Thank you so much. Racism, though, based off what? People asked to be treated equally and disregard the color of their skin, rather with police being profiled in public or stereotyped in career positions to be viewed equally, but they can't even get that. Illegal aliens firing and mistreating people based on color? The hard R? Even killing them? I don't have anywhere near as much to say regarding racism. It's there. It exists. And it's still prevalent. A lot of people say it doesn't exist anymore, or people want the attention, but literally, why? Less than 30 seconds of research or just leaving yo damn house can show you people are hated for any aspect of them. Just because it doesn't happen to you doesn't mean it doesn't happen at all. I don't understand the reason for the genuine hate of people of color. I need to know. Hillbilly. Franco. Nigga. White trash. Fuck you, nigga. What the fuck you rapping for? Crack your ass, crack it, got your rubber flag with your camel hat backwards, stains on your shirt with your fuck. This has got to be a hate crime in itself. I'm not racist. Not at all. Uh, I love all races. Love them all. Yeah, yeah. I love my country. There's just one more thing we gotta do to this song. Added some backing vocals, so let's try it out. Bye. I'm wild. I think that's pretty solid. Back to the topic. I don't get it. I don't. And unfortunately, I don't think I'll ever get it. Me when your mom and I know this video obviously won't abolish racism or homophobia and all form of prejudice across our country, but I felt that I should talk about this shit because it's better to minimize those types of people for all the babies in the world to enlighten them. I'm not gonna act like I'm the gay furry superman, I just don't get it. I don't get prejudice. Never will I understand how you wake up mad that someone's a woman, a person of color, or a man that likes to suck some. I don't get it. Oh man, this is gay as fuck. To myself, I am feeling away. I can't fall from accepting the fee. Made it down with the blood on my face. We don't shed every till we can weed. Watch them wearing they heart and they sleeves. My shit don't even come out the fleas. Niggas don't even pay no mind. Cause I'm dressing that shit is supreme. Nah, the NLFTS, black culture, the blueprint. No fuck with the BS, I'm doing.